Hello YouTube, this is Puck. Good morning. We're on Pair OS 8 and uh, I'm gonna show you how to install Skype. It's really easy. What you need to do is go to uh, Firefox, go to your uh, browser and simply browse to uh, the website of, um, of Skype and uh, let's first go to my home page because I already downloaded it what you should do is uh, Skype download and then you go to the site here and up here you can choose out of several distribution go for the Ubuntu 10 32-bit uh, assuming that you're also on the 32-bit uh, version eh, of uh, of of uh, OS 8 otherwise uh, it might not uh, work for you if you're on 64 bit I'm not sure if it's gonna work okay so I'm on the 32 bit system so I'm downloading this 32 bit version the install is straight up you just open the package installer and let it do the do And your webcam, everything will work. You know, I did this on an uh, on 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 another uh, laptop, and the one the the Mac, you know, the fake Mac, and everything works. Yo, everything works. So there we go. We hit install package. Up here, we must log in with our password, and then it will install the package. In the meanwhile, we also gonna take a look at how to install we'll have to wait let's not do too many things because we're also recording but uh, I also want to show you how to um, how to install uh, for my friends with tablets because I also made a video of installing this on a tablet but then I had no touch screen at least I had no screen um, keyboard so I'm gonna I'm gonna show you how to get this screen keyboard we're um, connecting to the Pair OS software center and there we are and only thing that you must type is on screen just type on screen and then you will find two keyboards up here and you must go for this one for the GNOME okay I'm gonna show you why here we're gonna log in real fast and install this as well And the process here is uh, really busy. I could not install all dependencies. And why was that? Hold on, let's wait. Probably because it's also installing something here. Let's wait a second. Okay, this one is installed. And let's install the package again. Um, installing dependencies okay so this uh, failed so what we're gonna do let's go to uh, let's go to edit and go, go to software sources because now I'm not sure if I'm let's see something here about this computer because this is already on Oh, this is 64-bit. You see, it does not work on 64-bit. <laughs> I thought I was on 32-bit. So, but for you, if you are on 32-bit, your Skype will work. It will just install fine. Okay? So, that's how to install Skype on the 32-bit. I will also put it in the description. Now, you can see that the 64-bit version of this OS won't accept a 32-bit version of Skype. So how to install Skype on a, on a 64-bit version? So let's see if we can choose for another distribution here. 32-bit, multi R, whatever that is, dynamic. I don't know. Shall we try the 12? Let's try the 12. This one is for Ubuntu 12. Let's see if that one works. Maybe that one is 64-bit. Okay, but about the keyboard peeps, we just install the keyboard, so we go to our launchpad. And first thing that we want to do 
is go to our keyboard onboard settings this one here and in the onboard setting you will say uh, start onboard hidden show floating icon then it will show something here in the corner it's really it's really handy if you're on a tablet and you can also say show uh, uh, auto show when editing text but that one is not working too good I'm not really happy about how it works because uh, sometimes it comes in the middle just uh, leave it this way if you need a keyboard just hit the tab here in the corner and then the keyboard will come up and then you can use it so that's it uh, of here you can say layout it will be on compact the team up here you can check uh, several uh, teams the ones you like and etc 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 i like it the way it is so it's just fine now and if you uh, set that then you go back to page two and you hit your onboard keyboard so there it is this is your uh, keyboard oops yeah i don't know if you can also move it around now it's gone and now it's show keyboard you see that so the keyboard is always coming on top, I think. So this is the way to get it. Uh, <laughs> and you can even make it a little bit bigger, you see. But this is... Uh, this will work a little bit different on your on your tablet <laughs> and this thing will not be in the taskbar test bar, but it will be somewhere wait let me see if uh, I can show it maybe in the preferences uh, start on the dot ah, there it is you see I was talking about this thing here so close so every time you need it you just hit this and then it will pop up you see if you want to close it you hit close so that's how to get a keyboard and the keyboard works just fine and if you log off then you will also see a little thing black thing here on top and when you hit it well not this one you will see something when you log off and then you can use that to uh to log in just look be creative you will find it so that's it, uh, that's how to install Skype, but we did, we don't know if uh, the 64-bit uh, of Skype will work. Let's see if this one works. This is version 12 for Ubuntu. I don't know if it's 64-bit or 32-bit, but we will have to find out about that. We say install package. let's see if this package will install until now it's installing oh oh installing dependencies and here it went wrong just now so let's see if this this is Mm. it's working peeps so for the 64 bit you need skype for ubuntu 12 you see that this is working baby girls it's finished in a second it will say package installed I think let's see if it ever already installed it Skype there you go Skype is installed man you see you don't see uh, that you don't see the close button that it's installed you see that you just close that man don't worry about it 
your Skype is installed. It's working. <laughs> there you go. Let's see if this uh, if this works. I think it's gonna work. So, you know, to install uh, Skype for um, the 64-bit version, you need Skype for Ubuntu 12, and for the 64-bit version, you can go for version 10. That will work just fine. And uh, the keyboard, you already saw how to install that. And so we did two things in one video today. So, you know, it's all good. I hope you uh, enjoyed uh, this video. I hope you think this video was cool. This video is a not fancy video. Um, you might hear the fan running on the background. And uh, you might also... Uh, yeah not see any text because i'm not gonna edit this video i'm just gonna post it the way i recorded it so you know i'm just gonna leave it this way so this product was completely created uh on the pair os 8 uh, and this is a free operating system i say it's a window windows killer it will get uh better and better and i think at version 10 it will be ready to hit the road and even beat windows 9 so thank you for watching once more uh, once once again and uh, if you like this video please uh, hit this video like of course you know and uh, if you want to know more of the videos i'm creating just subscribe to my channel and i see you in my next video bye bye